Hey, good morning everybody and welcome back to the Your Warfare Group. This is Juice and I have gotten a couple comments uh, from you guys about asking about where to put uh, individual mods or skins lately and uh, got one specific comment this morning on the 476 range objects that comes with our Nevada training mission, our Nevada NTTR training uh, MIS that we put up a couple days ago and I thought I would just go ahead and make a short video showing you guys what I do to get that to work. So. If you, if you guys download anything, look for a README file. It pretty much is self-explanatory. But if you are new to this, uh, you can muck it up. So this is probably uh, good if you're not familiar with, you know, adding third-party liveries or mods or anything like that. So, so we're going to go ahead and click on the link. It's going to take me to a new thing. I actually changed this link this morning because the one that goes directly to the 476 uh, was showing up as an error for me. So I went ahead and put this on it. But you go over here to the, the DCS forums post where Stuka had posted it from the 476. And the current version is June 2019, which is what I have. Go ahead and click on that. And then we can hit download. You can donate if you like to. I hit download and play the Jeopardy theme do, 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 do. and then right there is too too big to preview for your checker so now I'm gonna go over here show in folder I use Chrome and you can see this if you look at the zip I'll unzip it and right there there's your 476 range objects if I click in there you can see there's mods tech 476 range. That's where you want to get to. So what happens is, is when you get back to the zip file, right there, we'll go there, you'll unzip it, you'll open it up. They've actually created a little bit of a path for you in case you don't have this already. Because you, some of you won't have a mods or tech folder, but I'll show you what it should look like. So once we get to this one right here, I'll bring over my folder, what I already have. So here's my DCS open beta, it's part of your C drive, uh, or it could be a different letter drive for you. But basically, go over here to your mods with a capital M, and this is not the game files, this is your saved files, which saves a lot of your control settings and everything else. And you go over here to tech, and then you can see 476 range objects is the first folder. I'll open up that. So basically, <clears throat> if I was going to do this, I would drag this file into this folder into this whole folder right here. Like I'd drop it right in there and it would create this 476 range targets. And there's that's all you gotta do. You grab this and put it in your save games, mods, or save games, DCS World Open Beta or DCS World, mods, tech. And then you drop it in like that. That's all you gotta do. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. Again, once you get the hang of this, it becomes second nature. You guys have a great Sunday. Juice out.